I'd like to read it to you, and I'd like to read it to you, feel better. Like, I was like, what the fuck was Sarah talking about? Like, I was 16. Like, how, like, weird and kind of gay in a strange way? Like, 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 like well, it was gay, because, yeah, what you're imagining is, like, I'm reading, like, a passage from a book, but what I was reading was my poetry to a girl. That I like. So, okay, yeah, see, that's weird. I wish I didn't know that, because I was always imagining it as, like, sort of the like early, like, the origin story of Back in Her Head. No, it was me pushing my poetry on an unsuspecting polite person. Who was like, I don't know which uh, right. well, When I sing this next song, because I chose it for the record uh, to, to perform it, um, I like to imagine it as the origin story of Back in Her Head, like, you know, Sarah's talking. You know the song, Back in Her Head. Um, I was like, in her bed, and I'm like, my god, look at the link 20 years earlier, so I was like, I'd like to read to you at night. Okay. It's a whole story, you guys. To think about. Yeah, anyway. She sounds like a nightmare, like as if my back of your head had volumes and volumes of poetry. <laughs> it's not poetry, it's not a song anymore. And it also wasn't really poetry. Can I just, for the record, just change that? It was more like abstract non-sequitur, like, just sentences and statements. I was, let me just remind you of Sounds like poetry to me. But to me, it's very refined. Straight my ass and stage okay. <laughs> so you watch my TV set, what is I will make it better. Make it better. I want to call and ask what's up. Go to die, but then I stop. It's not the time. 